Hey YouTube, Abby is with you, and today we're going to be looking at the newest DPS that's going to be coming in Overwatch 2 in 2024. That's Venture. Venture is very special to the Overwatch team. They are the first non binary hero joining Overwatch. They're going to be centered around a unique mechanic where they get to go underground and traverse the map, then pop out and do projectile based damage. So we're finally getting a new projectile based dps hero i'm not going to waste more of your time i'm going to let the developers take it from here and then i'm going to give my first impressions of this next upcoming dps hero and what i think about them with that being said enjoy the gameplay footage like silly little portraits one of our artists talkie does those um before the, the the they're ready burrowing underground is kind of amazing so they can like burst up out of the ground um do additional damage has vertical mobility to it they move around the map really well. This, this weapon is amazing. It shoots a projectile out a set distance and it explodes right there. It's like, it's really nice to be able to hit people even around corners with that thing when they, when they duck out of the way. Um, the dig also, it, it like the most important part of this is it, it makes you invulnerable, you know? So it's like, you can't be hit when you're underground. It's a great, great way to escape. It's also a great way to get in close to players. Um, you pop up like that, um, and then you have a dash as well. And so the dash, you can do it in the air. You can dash underground if you want to when you're moving. Um, it's, all, it's all around just like a really, really fun kit to use. We have this, um, this idea or this goal that we try to do with heroes on Overwatch, and um, I think we're able to hit it on, on DPS heroes a little bit more than some of the other ones. But as much as we can, we just want it to be fun to hit the buttons. You know, like move around a space and just kind of have like some joy there. And Venture, I think, is, is one of those heroes um, where they just um, are fun to hit the buttons with. All right, let's run it back nice and slow and talk about Venture real quick. So they look really, really interesting. They got um, two abilities that got showcased, no ultimate as of yet. So we can maybe speculate on what the ultimate is going to look like. So I was actually very, very wrong about Venture's. Um, weapon when we were on the live stream and we saw the first sighting of them i thought the weapon was actually a flamethrower and honestly i would have loved it if we got a flamethrower dps i know technically may already has that part covered but it would be really nice to have a new character centered around fire you know i know technically mauga is also that but you guys know what i'm trying to talk about a traditional flamethrower character would be nice to have so uh ventures are new dps and their um left click projectile shots are simple and straightforward it if you kind of pay attention to the way the rock shoots out it does seem like they shoot at rocks the rock kind of reminds me of roadhog's um right click that he has right his alternate fire it seems like you shoot this rock and then it splits into like little rocks after a certain point and does damage so you know it could it could be like um it could be like roadhog's out fire where you shoot rocks and after they travel a certain time, they actually split into more rocks. Now, we have two abilities that got showcased. One is the dash with the drill. And the other one is the burrow ability that's used to move around where the character uh, venture is also invulnerable. Another unique thing to also note that I'll show on the screen now is anytime venture uses the drill ability, they actually push, they actually give themselves 50 shield HP. I find that really really interesting i don't understand what the point of this drill attack is supposed to be it doesn't really seem all that threatening now to be fair in the gameplay showcase that the developers did they didn't really show off um the power of this ability although for now of course venture is in super early testing stages in alpha they do seem to be a little bit underwhelming i hope that you know um they are not underwhelming but they seem a little bit uh simplistic like it's not um echo levels of complexity and things like that it's a really really simple uh, straightforward character that just shoots um can move around and can sort of tickle you with the drill uh get a little bit tanky um if i'm not mistaken when they use the movement if they use the uh movement um they also gain that shield hp again so you can see over here as soon as they enter the burrowed state for the three seconds that they're there uh you know they get some shield hp so that's definitely something worth keeping an eye on is it does look like that venture is going to be a little bit of a tanky uh dps hero so another thing to note about venture as well is the fact that the projectile seems to be really really quick 
in the way that it's fired out so most likely it's going to be um it, it seems like it has the same speed uh as a charged up hanzo arrow like at least on on first glance um it does look like it shoots just as fast as that if not that then it looks like a junkrat grenade without without the bounce on it honestly so venture seems to be uh really really interesting i really hope the ultimate has some some good potential to it because so far they just seem like a very mobile basic projectile dps um nothing too crazy is brought to the kit in terms of interactions it does seem like they are meant to be a poke dps uh that just wants to sit back with like these poke based comps and burst people down at close range again we've not really seen the full potential of this drill but it does seem like that you want to if, if you get dived upon then you might want to use the drill to tickle people away from you and then use your burrow to quickly make a run for it uh, away from dive dps because it doesn't seem like uh venture wants to take um close range uh you know battles against um fellow dps characters and things like that so most likely characters like tracer sombra genji uh maybe even cassidy and hanzo are going to be good into venture you know if we if we just do the basics uh of talking about venture and you know the way that they want to play um it seems like they will be competing with cass uh ash uh, hanzo uh may sojourn in this mid-range to long-range dps slot uh we don't know again we don't know the full numbers and everything but it does seem like they are a poke based dps um mid-range so far from the footage that they did show us it again seems like they don't really seem that over the top uh at mid-range they don't seem all too comfortable about it um the drill again like of course this is all alpha footage so it's all subject to change but from what we can take away and if they do sit on these abilities then you know they could use a little bit of help um in that regard that maybe the drill applies some good pressure damage when somebody's close to you um but you know what i like about them is that they definitely have a little bit of skill ceiling to them in all their abilities um and yeah the weakness of this character uh, i like this like a lot of the new characters that are coming out malga venture um it seems like they are keeping that in mind that how can we create a weakness in a character and looks like venture's weakness is that they don't want to be contested uh, up close and personal when that happens you definitely want to use your movement ability to start running away now as for the ultimate i, I honestly don't know what you do for an ultimate for a character like this but it would be so cool if that gun enters the drill mode permanently and you can like burrow around and just drill people down or something like that it would be like a hybrid poke and melee based dps character uh at least when they enter the ultimate so it, it would just be really cool running around drilling people down so i don't know like what do you guys think what would you like to see from venture in terms of an ultimate they didn't really showcase it i guess they do want to hide some surprise factor but before I um, go away from this video, I want you guys to take note of this screen over here. If you look really, really carefully, you can see that we have a new support hero on the bottom right of the screen in the support role. And we also have a new tank over there at the tank role. Now, we do know some things about the support hero. The support hero is called, um, at the moment, the code name is Space Ranger. But we don't know anything about the tank hero just yet. Space Ranger, the new support hero they want her to be focused on verticality she seems to be from the um uh, colony on mars so horizon lunar colony um this hero uh you know it could be interesting could be our first support where maybe they mess around with zero gravity and things like that so you know if they're all about vertical movement maybe they can control their own gravity move around and things like that i don't know man i i love uh movement based heroes so i'm more excited for the new support than i am for the dps even though the dps is my main role but these days i have been playing more support so you you know you know they, they they're turning me over they're they're shifting me up like support is just such a fun role to play compared to every other role anyways everybody that is it that's going to be it for this video if you enjoy this type of content and you want to stick around for more overwatch news be sure to hit like and subscribe and support the channel for free and keeps you updated on what's going to be coming up for overwatch i have more videos coming out uh, detailing uh, what blizzcon was all about so if you're interested please do stick around with the channel if you want to support me financially you can do that by using the super chat feature down below until i get a patreon and all that other good stuff running now with that being said i will see you guys in the next video